die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die. Hell, bet. <laughs> Listen, see, I could tell a good lie, but I'm the truth in its purest form. Yeah, fuck bundles, we get... Yo, yo, be the blogger, talk that shit, TV. We back with another motherfucking prediction blog. <coughs> we got motherfucking headshots three coming up real soon. Uh, first battle of the night, we got SBM Fitted versus Tony Snow. Um, Tony Snow, nobody really knows what Snow can do yet because Snow haven't been able to get in the ring uh, due to people ducking... And, you know, he's just, he's one of the newer faces on the scene that really don't have a track record. So, you know, we got to see what makes sense. And uh, this would be his first time to, you know, let something show. Um, SBM Fitted, not the best nigga in the battle rap world, but uh, he might come through. Uh, he might be a little bit overconfident, you know, having a nigga who we don't know what he can do. But um, I think it's a three-round battle. Hopefully they do their damn thing. Uh, I'll be in the building shooting, of course. But shit should be lit, though. Uh, next up, we got motherfucking... Uh, matter of fact, I didn't even say who, who I got winning this shit. Um, I don't know. It's a hard one because Fitted might not... Fitted might not be on shit. Fitted be bullshitting sometimes. Uh, Snow, he seemed real eager than shit. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm gonna go with Tony Snow. We don't know what he can do. Um, by the way, he dressed, I could tell he got a little uh, hip hop vibe in him, as far as you know him as a, a regular person in hip hop. So we gonna see what he can do. Uh, I got Tony Snow two one. Um, <clears throat> next battle, we got motherfucking uh, Young Heem versus Rex the God. Uh, Heem versus Rex. Um, Heem, I don't think Heem can, he, he can't bar with Rex. Like, Heem got bars, but Rex shit, Rex is gonna make him look kind of basic. It's a three round battle, too. Um, I got Rex 2 1, possible 3 0. Um, that's just how I gotta call it. Heem, that's my guy. You know, I fuck with you, but I'm sorry, my G. 2130 Rex the God. I ain't gonna spend too much time on that one. Uh, next up, Mani Mula versus JBF Shooter. Uh, Mani Mula. <sighs> this is gonna be your first local battle in a while that people don't treat like the smoke break battle because you battle a shooter. Um, shooter, um, I kind of don't know what to expect. I know Mani Mula gonna have some bars, but uh, I kind of don't know what to expect from Shooter. Um, I don't know if it's a two round or a one round, I mean a, a three round or a one round. Uh, hopefully it's a three round battle. This Monty Moolah, he, he don't really, I, I don't think I ever seen Monty Moolah do a one round battle. So, shit should be, be real, real, real funny. You know, a shooter battling Monty Moolah, it's just, the battle just sound funny. But, um. In the building, regardless, it's going to look like Shooter 1, especially how, you know, the gas be up, you know, when certain motherfuckers rap. But we ain't going to talk about all that right now. Um, I got Shooter 2-1. Um, I don't know. I just I just got a feeling. Shooter 2-1. Um, I got Mani Mula choking in the second round. This is a prediction, so I'm just kind of, I'm kind of just telling y'all why I just feel like this. I just got a feeling Monty Moolah gonna choke. Like, straight like that. But, um, next up, we got motherfucking Foway versus Clever. Now, I already done told Foway how I feel about this. Clever gonna be way too clever for him. Um, I hope Foway don't get 30. I don't give a fuck what niggas talking about in the building. Um, Hopefully the battle reaches enough people to where you can get a real opinions from the outside world. But um Four Way, he's definitely getting better. Everybody knows that Four Way got bars, but I just know Clever is gonna be more clever. He's gonna be more strategic. It's not gonna it, I, I don't know, man. I, I don't know. I just got I got clever taking that one. Uh two one, possible three oh. Simple as that. 
Uh, next up, we got motherfucking JBF Capo versus motherfucking Money Mitch. JBF Capo versus Money Mitch. Um, this is going to be a real energetic battle. Um, hopefully the crowd let them cook and they don't be doing too much like react and get up off it like let like let let them let them cook and they like the, get your reaction off show your love then let the boy cook but um i got mitch taking this one uh two one just off experience and uh mitch mitch penn is getting a whole lot better he's uh he's learning more he done battle um for sure better comp competition i'm not just going say niggas is better than a nigga but they are more proven competition you know than capo you know he had a a, a decent first battle um i i fucked with you know a lot of his material but mitch is proven you know um he's had his 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 stumbles or whatnot but i'm running with mitch 2-1 on this one um i'm a i'm a trusting that that was currently my favorite um I'm in a bind now. I ain't gonna talk about that though. But um <clears throat> yeah, Mitch two one on that. Um next up we got motherfucking Killer Corso versus um Banks. We just gonna go with Banks. Uh, all family, no friends, or whatever. It's just sound I saying A F N F. Like, you know, Banks. You know? But um Corso versus Banks. Um I hope Corso prepare for this like prepare like don't ah, like you could do your little freestyle you know type shit in and out what you can get off but have something solid that you know you got for for the young dog because the young dog like he show a lot of different elements like and i i, I personally kind of, i fuck with what he doing i ain't gonna say i fuck with all his shit but he shows potential of when he really get this shit down packed he's gonna be very scary and he might go up a level on corso so um i'm really you know i don't really know corso has proven to be surprising um i hope you know banks niggas kind of keep down the heckling and the gas and this could kind of be a, a, a real good battle and knowing that Corso can rebuttal and shit like that too. So it's gonna be a real good one. Um I'ma go with motherfucking I'm gonna go with my nigga Corso on this one. Um it could go either way still at the end of the day, but I'm gonna go with Corso off experience and then he does have the ability to rebuttal some shit and kinda shift the momentum and shit like that. But <clears throat> uh, that's just how we gonna rock out with that. Two one Corso. Um, next up, we got motherfucking Bad Light Bird versus Jag. This the one battle that got the whole battle rap world like, what the fuck? Like, how did this happen? I was looking at this shit like, matter of fact, I ain't even say nothing when I seen it. I'm, I'm Bad Light Bird versus Gangsta Jag. Like, what the fuck? Like, where did that come from? Then I, you know, seen it was for real, and I'm like, you know, ah, oh, shit. Um, I got birds smoking Jag, like, like, I ain't gonna say bad, but she gonna, I got, I got birds smoking Jazz, I hope it's a three round, I mean, I call the nigga Jazz, Jag, uh, I hope it's a three round battle, uh, if it is, I got bird 2-1, I ain't just gonna say she gonna 30 the man, but bird 2-1, uh, for multiple reasons, I kinda know some of the angles she's going to come with on Jag, and uh, it's going to get ugly in there. But, um, <clears throat> yeah, that's that. Um, and then for the motherfucking main event, we got motherfucking Lex Luthor versus Mr. Mills. Um, this battle was supposed to go down 420 at um, uh, We Want Smoke, but, you know, due to some technical difficulties, um, it didn't go down. And it's going down now. Um, this is a battle I was looking forward to seeing. This is um, it's a battle that that I could see being booked on. You know, in in, a, in any any league, pretty much that it will come to thought to. You know, so 
Hope it's a good joint. Um, I kind of favor Mr. Mills more. You know, I'm more of a Mr. Mills fan than I am a Lex Luthor fan. But um, in the build, as far as our crowd go, I know as far as what Lex Luthor do, he's going to have He's going to have that shit in the building for our crowd. You know, they're going to like how he, you know, lay his shit down. Uh, Mills, um, I think they're going to like Mills too. But as far as the humor aspect of Lex Luthor, probably is going to steal the show in the building. But um, I'm going with Mr. Mills 2-1 uh, from a lyrical standpoint. You know, simple as that. Um, but... Hopefully it's a good joint. Headshots 3, May 26, Melly's Mall, Bloody Scene, it's Be The Blogger, Talk That Shit TV, Hank Nation, we out this bitch. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die. Die, motherfucker, die, motherfucker, die, hell, bet. <laughs> Listen, see, I could tell.